In this video, I'll demonstrate how to file a beveled edge onto a piece of aluminum, such as your inspection panel cover. Uh, you'll always need to remove the protective plastic. Always remove the protective plastic from the piece you're working on. I like to place it on a nice, flat, smooth uh, table edge. And the trick to this one here is, is holding your file at 45 degrees. If you want a 45 degree chamfer is what we do. So if you're not sure what 45 degrees is, you can take a, a little tri-square like this and set it up and see that that's the angle that you'd be holding your file at. So holding my file at that angle, I'll start in, on, the, on the corner here and just start filing it back and forth in reciprocating action and start rotating the panel around. I've got a fairly coarse file here. As long as my file is held at a 45 degree angle, I'll get a 45 degree chamfer. I've done a little bit here around the edge. I'm going to go with a, uh, a fine file to make it a little bit smoother now that I've been a staying at 45 degrees again. And now looking at the, at the panel itself, you can see looking down on it that there's a, a shiny edge around the edge of the panel. And that shiny edge has got to be the same distance as if you look on it on the on edge this way here as the flat part that we, which isn't chamfered. So you'll end up with 50% of the material not being chamfered, 50% of the thickness not being chamfered as visible on edge. And when you look down on it, you'll see the shiny area. And you want to carry that shiny area, that distance of the chamfer all the way around, evenly, all across around the panel. And it's just done by eye. So hand filing at a 45 degree angle, all the way around, just rotating the, the, the piece of material on the bench rather than trying to rotate your file around, well, it should produce a really nice chamfer. Don't forget to smooth it out. Polishing with a little bit of uh, emery cloth like this here, or sandpaper, deburring, or you can even use scotch Brite. And uh, if you're just not too harsh on it, you'll see it makes slight marking in the L-clad, but that's totally acceptable for our shop projects. So that's all there is to chamfering an edge using a hand file.